Okay, welcome back everyone, or welcome everyone if it's the first time here. Weird place to jump in, but hey, you do you. And, like I said, the glue I put on has set up. I did take a better look at the uh, picture and the instructions, and I, so, let me get that to focus in. So I did go back and scrape the glue off the, the center thing, because that is going to require supports are going to be applied to this one, so I just did the either side on the second one I went through. And with that being said, let's see if we can get these things to stick in this time. <laughs> Let's say it did improve the stability significantly. Adding those in. I said that and then I'm but it's still quite seems to be quite tricky. This is gonna be a, a the trickiest step, I think. Getting all these pieces together. You yeah, see that's still I don't know, wobbling out of shape here, so that's Ah, get in there. Okay. Push together. See, that one's... Oh, this one's loose. That's... Ah! <laughs> What I need is basically a hole supporting around the edges, so these will. Maybe if, maybe I try upright. I don't, maybe get a little gravity assistance here. You fell over, so that's not good. Decided lack of stability. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, let's do it. Too. Okay. I do not see any way. all these lined up with the opposite side. Although if I did, yeah. Okay. Okay, so. Yeah. 
handy dandy tweezers. Where'd you go? <laughs> Couple of them to drop on. Maybe I can. Nope. nope. It's all gonna fall apart when I'm doing this. I can tell. All right. Okay. This thing's gonna make me say some bad words, I think. <laughs> okay. Holy cow, we're making progress. <laughs> Holy smokes. <laughs> I'm in a bit of shock that, that went together like that. <laughs> Even that close. Even though I'm not done yet. Okay. 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 Get on down there. Holy smokes. <laughs> oh my goodness. I that I am ecstatic with that. <laughs> I can't tell you how proud I am. <laughs> They're not all staying down, but I would assume there's going to be more pieces going on top of these studs to, that will hold them in place. Wow. Okay. Now I'm scared it's going to fall apart anytime I pick it up and move it. But for the time being, let's just set this aside because we're moving on to a different section now. Stay. Stay. Okay. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, that's that went much better than I thought it was. I'll be honest. I, I was... I thought I was going to be working like an hour and a half on that one piece. <laughs> now, let's see. <coughs> let's see. Let's, let's get G6 out of there. And C4. C1, C2, C3. 
And oh, get my sand in done on that. times 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That'll finish up, up on section A. Hey, you got more room on my desk. <laughs> their way around the spokes. Same part again. Okay. Okay, then G eight. You sort of lines up with those in theory. Oh, what's up? some of them are mm hmm okay that must be <laughs> one must be taller than the others okay that must be the Supposed to go on the taller one. And so you okay. There it went. Okay, just had to wiggle them a little bit to make them all snap into place on that. But they are all, like I said, there's that one right here that's taller than the rest of them. Okay. <laughs> Let's 
and peach seven which looks like it's gonna be about the same same looks like we're gonna rinse and repeat on that one. Oh yeah Looks like okay. The one with the taller one is unique. Okay, be three times nine. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and that finishes up with B as well. More room on the desk. Sand on the edges there. Probably not necessary. I just sort of like it. <laughs> okay. We'll just work our way around on these. bit that tall one for the drive shaft connects. <laughs> okay. H9. What's that? 18 minutes. What's next? Okay. I'm going to go get a start on the next step. Okay, so D. Okay. Part C is the one with the, the oh, elevated notch there. Show. And part D is the one that's flush. And that's the one we're using now. C5 and C7. And. Okay, so it's. Alternating C5s and C7s. So C5, are you C7? Yeah, these are C7s. Okay. And I feel like these are going to be very easy to break to. Okay, so C5 goes on. Oop. I think it's going to go. There it went. There it went. Yeah. And C7. Okay, it looks like, yeah, the uh, circle on the end is slightly smaller on the C7, so probably just an aesthetic thing, but there it is. 
Actually, it says with just those two on, <laughs> we're supposed to. Okay, then we're back to alternating five and sevens. And so I guess. Okay, we're supposed to do it in situ. Okay, so I guess I would assume just plunk it down in here, and mash them onto there, where they line up. Okay, and then you... Okay. <laughs> that worked. Then... C7. Okay. <laughs> Seven. Come all the way on. There you are. And yep. yep, there we go. All right. I'll be honest, I think I'm over the hump here. I think the, I've got enough stuff together here that I'm getting fairly stabilized. The structure is sort of holding itself together better now. And of course, when I get confidence, when things generally go bad, so let's. <laughs> This is longer than I intended, but I, like I told y'all last time, I was, I was going to experiment with making this one a little bit longer so it'd be, the series would actually be shorter, I think. So I may just see how long y'all stick with me on this. <laughs> Seven. 
Oh, last one. Dang, that was... <laughs> All right. And that's... Like I said, that's got some real structure to it now. So... I may... Ooh, that's going to be... Eh, that's, okay, that's pretty solid. That's the thing about mashing down on those to make them line up on the other side, but let's... Make sure that's what I'm supposed to be doing. <laughs> yep, and yep. So, same thing. Got a C5. Oh, move the camera. Try again. C5 and a C7. There we go. And do it with the tears. Yep. Want the notch out. The, the one hump out. Okay. Now just line up a couple of them for me, guys. Come on. Ooh. Okay. That was a bad feeling, but not a. Okay, and just a little snug. That's the problem, that. Once you got them on, you can apply pressure to both sides to really cinch them into place. And now that was C5, C7, C5. Oh, I hope I did line those up right. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Pay attention to which, make sure your C5 and your the top and the bottom are the same. I got lucky and just inadvertently did it right. Pressure to both sides, make sure they're cinched in good. Mm -hmm. C7. Alright, you know what I'm That clicking sound I just sort of figured out <laughs> is these. These pieces here aren't lined up, and that's the clickings when they go down into position. It's not. It seems like it'd be a bad sound, but it's not. Let's see, five. And this is the. I'm pretty sure this is the side that I put the glue on the, the studs I need to use here because it's it is a little particular on getting these top ones, these outer rims put together. C seven. Okay, sorry about that guys. I didn't realize I I still hadn't reset my camera for American settings yet, so it was it cut off without telling me. <laughs> but as you can see it was the same thing all the way around and I've got both sides all the 
Are these can be considered struts? I'm not sure. Anyway, all the they're all installed now, and this does feel fairly. It doesn't feel sturdy, <laughs> but it feels like it's not going to fall apart now. Uh, you know, let's say, and it's it's. I think that's you know. <clears throat> that may be a sign for it's time for me to stop that I didn't realize I was, I was done. <laughs> okay, but uh, thanks for watching, everybody. Like, subscribe, comment, complain, share, do whatever you want to with all that. Be good to one another, stay healthy, and I'll see you next time. Bye.